Hello friends, this is Jess. You can also find me on Instagram as Knit Plan Jess. Thank you guys so much for joining to me today. Blech. Thank you for joining me today. I really appreciate it. To my new viewers, welcome. And to my returning viewers, welcome back. This is the third video that I have recorded today and I'm feeling like I'm getting tongue tied. But guys, I'm like so productive today because I am getting ready to do a daily plan with me for um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. This is going to conclude my daily spreads for next week. Like, I am super pumped about that. I love having my daily spreads already done for the week because that way when I go to use them, I know for a fact that like if I wanted to plan ahead, I could. And I'm, I'm literally just going to be ready for it. And also, we're doing the 25th, the 26th, and the 27th. So I'm going to be starting in March soon. OMG. I'm really excited about that, actually. Like, because I like to remind myself that as the months go on, and I continue to do these daily plan with me's and I just continue to do like the daily spreads. I am going to have two beautiful daily planners because I do six months in each one by the end of the year and it's going to be fantastic. I have a full 12 months for 2021 and I cannot wait to have it for 2022 as well. So we're going to be doing like I said, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So we have Free Spirit 1, Free Spirit 2, and Fresh Start. I also have Mojo Jojo Check It Off in case I need a checklist and that is sitting off to the side. Let's get started. So, number one, I am about to empty out a sticker sheet. If I see one little sticker sitting on the page, I might as well just use it, right? I mean, come on, obviously it's, it's sad and it wants to be used, so let's do it. Um, I guess I'm going to use, okay, let's try this again. I guess I'm going to use these. Okay, I don't think I'm going to use that one now. That was kind of pitiful. Let's try this one. that really shows you that I haven't used these yet and I didn't realize how delicate that it was when I went to tear it when I went to pull it off of the sticker sheet. I'm going to grab just a few more of the arrows. I don't know exactly how I'm going to use them, so this could be rather interesting. Um not going to use those. Ooh, that could be pretty, but nope. Nope. All right, let's see. Um, it has been so long since I have used these sticker books. <laughs> we're going to use this one that says, She walked in moon dust and stars were sprinkled in her hair. I love that quote. I'm just also trying to see what I have for headers. Oh, I just kind of thought of something. Instead of a checklist, I'm going to use these, but I'm going to wait until I go to actually put the stickers down on the spread and I will come back to this page. Or I could use these ones. I think I'm going to use the other one. All right, for colors, we're going to use this blue and we're going to use this black. I kind of like the idea of mixing up other colors. So let's use that. Um, I really need to find like a good quote sticker and I can't find one yet unless I use this one that says you are made of stardust. I obviously I don't know how like the stars are going to kind of mix with the arrows, but that's what I'm using. Um, 
Do I need any more functional? I'm not sure. Ooh, let's use this one because it just, it'll match with that and I will think it'll be super pretty. I wanna use this one. Yeah, see, I don't, I don't quite know. Obviously I don't quite know what's going on yet. So I'm just kind of pulling stickers. Although I am now remembering why I love these, why I love these sticker books so much. I think I bought like two of these because I'm like, oh, this is like the most amazing sticker book ever. I was very new to the Happy Planner and I didn't quite realize how many sticker books that they released at one time. So it, it's kind of crazy now that I was buying duplicates at this time. And because now I'm like, I would be crazy to buy a duplicate. I'm like, there's going to be so many other sticker books. I can't buy a duplicate. All right. I'm going to go ahead and just decorate this page. So in that way, when I go to do Saturday and Sunday, I can pull all of the stickers at once. Um, we're going to put this up here and what I was also think let me get that that straight what I was also thinking was like maybe putting those like that oh my goodness whoops all right, so I am so excited. So it is, like I mentioned, it is Friday. Um, it's actually Friday the 18th. So there is uh, the spring release for the Happy Planner coming up soon. Um, by the time that you're watching this video, it will have already gone for sale, but I am so excited. I think what I'm most excited about is the the black filler paper. And they also have stickers that are specifically made for the black filler paper and it's supposed to like pop on the filler paper. And I can't wait to get it. I love black filler paper. Like I love I love blackout paper. But what I would love to do is actually use that filler paper. So I think I'm only probably just gonna get like one like one pack. I'm not gonna buy the actual Happy Notes. I'm just gonna just buy the filler paper. What I would love to do is I would love to take that filler paper and use it to actually um, like go on my regular planner spreads. So Tom, basically Tombow adhesive to the rescue for all of those spreads. But yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. All right, I'm gonna put this down here. And I forgot my washi strips, of course. I always forget the washi. I love these little clear washi strips because it, it just adds like a little fun touch to the page. There we go. And then I have one that I'm gonna put up here and I'm gonna right there. I really like this spread so far. Okay, so now I also wanted, I wanted this to do, I was thinking of, I don't know what I was thinking of doing. Um, I, I kind of like that. Like I kind of like the idea of layering it, but I don't like the green one with it. I could do the gray one. I'm not sure I'm feeling that. Like I think originally I was thinking about using this with that, but I don't really, I don't like that. Okay, so now we're just gonna plan on putting some of these arrows coming out and if they are gonna be behind, a st or if they're, if they're meant to be behind, I'm just gonna trim it down. Um, so 
So like this one is I'm actually going to cut it. So it's kind of makes it look like that it's like the middle part of it's behind. I need my tweezers. I don't know if I cut that very well either. That looks kind of cute, I guess. Sometimes when you use a sticker book up so much, you kind of get left with like stickers that I think you kind of like struggle to figure out how to use. That's basically how I'm feeling right now. Um, let me cut this. Let me cut this. And there are so many functional stickers left in this book that it's like, I need to use it. And I don't know, I kind of was thinking maybe I shouldn't use this one. I don't like how all of the arrows are going the same way. Here, let's do this. Um, hi. Are we supposed to know what we're doing? Because sometimes I don't feel like I do. Now let's take this off. And I also want to kind of trim off this right here. It's stuck to my desk. Oh, that's fine. Okay. I I think I'm going to say that this one is done. I think it actually turned out kind of cute. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I need my checklist stickers. I don't like just using the gray checklist that's on here, which is funny because on my dashboard, I don't need to put like a checklist down or any type of bullets. I just use, I just use the checklist that's on the page. But for whatever reason, when it comes to my daily, I prefer to use actual bullet points or my beloved checklist stickers. So we've got one, two, and I'm going to do them in a pattern. So I'm basically having each of the colors on the opposite ends and they're going to meet in the middle into one color. So let's do the gray and this taupe. And then I'm just going to need one more color after that. I think I'm going to do maybe like the purple. Is there purple? I'll do like this dark blue. Wait, no, I already have that one. I don't know. I'll do a green. I don't have a green yet. See, this turned out perfect. Like this is exactly what I was hoping for in terms of how the colors would work out. That is cute. Okay, I need to actually put back some stickers. So let me go ahead and do that really quickly. So then that way I will have a completely blank page when I go to pull stickers for the next two spreads. All right, now let's go ahead and do February 26th and 27th. So 26 is going to be using Free Spirit 2, which is very similar to Free Spirit 1, but it's kind of just like a softer vibe. And I think I'm going to go with the purple tones because I really like the purple. And I can't use a silver because apparently I'm already using a sticker that has the copper. I don't like when they mix two different foil colors in one sticker book. Um, I want this one. I did not even realize that I haven't touched these florals yet. Well, I know what I'm using. I also feel like I went a while with not using florals in spreads. And now all of a sudden I am getting to all, oh, Apparently I used up all, all of the copper ones with the exception of two, sorry. Okay, anyways, I went a while with not using any um, florals and now all of a sudden I feel like I'm using so many florals. Okay, when I do my checklist, I'm gonna use these stickers. So I will come back for those. 
Also, I want to use something, I'm gonna do like a to-do or a big plans over that top three because I don't want, I don't want it to be top three because that's not what I'm gonna be using it for. Or we could use a note to self. I'm just gonna put that down there right now. Oh, here we go. So let's say, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use this one. And then I'm gonna use this one that says Dream on Dreamer. And I'm gonna do it like that and use it for the top corner or this top corner. It's gonna be super pretty, I think. Um, if you're ever looking for canceled and rescheduled stickers, they are in this book. I had apparently missed that. Um, I absolutely kind of love this and I wish that I had a different color other than pink. Because now what I kind of want to do is I kind of want to turn this into a check, like um, an hourly page. Oh, I don't, I don't think I can. Um, unless I was using like this, I think it's gonna be really difficult. I'm not gonna be using any of those. You was one that says spread kindness. And I don't think I want any of those. I'm trying to also find some more. I like this one. Have a brave heart. Um, I'm also trying to find some more stickers that like I could use as like a quote. Um, okay, so what I did with this one, I just cut off this piece that says today, which I could technically use somewhere else. So let's do that. But I really just, I didn't want like a monthly box. I just wanted to be just a simple box. I am thinking that that might be it. Yeah. So as I, as I was flipping through that, I was also getting a lot of, I'm going to say like a lot of almost wellness vibes because there were a lot of stickers that I thought I remembered seeing um, in the wellness. This was like the wellness from, oh, see, I'm going to do it just like that. This was the wellness, the, uh, the OG wellness that came out back in like 2018, I guess. Um, the mini wellness was actually one of my very first sticker books. My, so when I originally, when I got my, oops. So when I got my first happy planner, um, one of my friends, she was actually the one who, who influenced me and she had found the Miss Maker at Joanne's and she was like, Hey, this is really cute. You know, she's like, I'm going to try it. Would you be interested? So I'm like, sure. You know, I hadn't seen it at my like I hadn't gone to my Joann's and and seen it um I was using like note paper for planning at this time um so she you know so she was kind of showing me she was like texting me pictures and she's like so what would you be interested in this this so you know I kind of had her pick out like a few things um and she you know she purchased it from me I was kind of like one of those things where I just paid her back and she sent me the Miss Maker um, mini sticker book. She sent me um, the Miss Maker accessory pack. So it had like the stickers, it had the sticky notes, and it had those note cards. Uh, the mini wellness sticker book. And there was a couple, like a couple little other, other accessories that she sent to me. And that was literally like what brought me into the happy planner world. All right, so bad news. I don't have room for this quote and I also really don't have room for these florals but I'm gonna make the florals work and 
I think what I'm going to plan on doing is like these florals are going to come out the bottom, which you can't see. Sorry. I'm going to do that and we're going to trim it down the side. I also brought my trash can over here so I can really easily throw away the scraps. All right, I've got that. And then I also do want to use these. So I was thinking, why not have like the florals coming out like that? That way it's just, they're, they're layered over that big old watercolor splotch that I really just wanted for the color. And you can do the same thing because I can't put the purple ones over the purple watercolor splotch splotch so there we go i could always though use like the purple up here which this i'm just going to trim oh i forgot to pick the stickers for the next book that's okay and then we have one more stickers which I could do it like this. I almost cut my hand. I would really rather not have an injury while I'm filming. Oh, there we go. Okay, now all I need to do is just get the stickers to go down the side, um, the bullets for my checklist and then we are done. So I'm going to do kind of like the same thing where I do multi, um, or should I stick with just, no, I should stick with just the black and purple. Why am I using other colors over here? Like I use the other colors in the other one because of the fact that it had so many colors, but this one is just purple and black, which by the way, well, and copper too, but I don't have any copper copper flags. Um, I absolutely adore this one so far. Whoops. Okay, now, um, although I do wish that I had used some checklists just because it's a lot faster than putting down the little flags, but gotta use up the stickers, right? Of the okay, I'm gonna do it. Um, actually, what if I use the dark gray? I mean, I I think it matches with it pretty well. I'm gonna do this too. So then that way, what I can actually do is basically have like a I can use this for something, and then I can use this for something else. I think this turned out super, super cute. I really, really love it. All right, which means free spirit is done. And now we are going to pull stickers. We're going to ignore that sticker right there. And we're going to pull stickers for the 27th, which is Fresh Start. Fresh Start is one of my favorite sticker books ever. Um, like sometimes... Sometimes the school sticker books give me like really, really strong school teacher student vibes. This one, honestly, like it does and it doesn't. Um, I want a super colorful spread. So we're gonna use these because those are just fun, especially because I can use a white pen over this. And this is Sunday, so I know that I'll have lots of stuff. And then let's use these checklists for my actual um, to-do list that's going to go down the side. We'll just use all three of them. I love these little pencils. I think we're going to use a couple. I'm kind of thinking of using like some of these stickers as like a little decoration behind it. Not for any other reason, honestly. But hey, it, it allows me to use them up, so that's what's important. 
Um, we're not going to use that. Not going to use that. Let's go with this one for the quote. Find what makes your heart smile. We're going to use this Dear Weekend. Let's stay for a while. What if I was to put this choose to shine like literally right in there? Oh, I love it. That makes me happy. Okay. This is when I, I need to use these up. I can't just let this page go. I will find a reason why I, sh why I can use these. Um, I could probably just like, seriously, just let this page stay, but that's okay. Whatever. I'm not going to do it. Okay. Now I don't need those. I don't think I need those. <sighs> no quote of the day. I'm, my brain is too tired sometimes for quotes of the day. I was hoping to find like some kind of to do. Um, I like this coffee first. I was also thinking, let's use the one that says best weekend ever because it's appropriate for a Sunday because of the fact that it is still, um, since Monday is a day off for me, I'm still considering, like I'm considering Monday to be the weekend too. And then I really just wanted to use some washi strips and I'm not gonna use any of those. And then I've got a whole nother sheet of them right there. Let's see what, what, what we, blah, blah, blah. let's see what we can do with this. First of all, washi strip. I'm gonna put you, I don't know what that was. I'm gonna rip it and we're gonna put it also right here. Or, because I was thinking right there, but then it's kind of, kind of cover up. Uh, let's just do it. And then I have a pink and I'm just going to kind of rip one side just a little bit and not use it. And then I'm going to do the same thing with this side. Although I really should have chosen like a different color. I don't like that one. We're not going to use it. I have no problem throwing that in the rip pile, by the way. All right. I said I wanted the best weekend ever right here. Four day weekends are the best ever. And then that's going to go right there. That's my quote. Find what makes your heart smile. I love that quote. And then I also want to use this coffee first. That is cute. Okay. I love my functional stickers. I mentioned checklists. I honestly don't know like what all. Oh, wait a minute. I just thought of something. Okay, so today is Friday the 18th and this week Sunday is I, I swear I thought I was I thought I was doing um, the spread for the 20th because the 21st Monday is a holiday and this is not this is the following week this Sunday is part of a two-day weekend which kind of sucks I said it I just two to two day weekends are not fun I'm convinced that I need to um, win the lottery so then that way I can be able to stay home and not have to work or I could literally just turn my job into YouTube um, and I could just do this all the time. That would make me very happy. All right, we're going to put these little apples over here now. Struggling. 
I just think that these are just so cute. Um, I, okay, so I was at Michael's and they had, like this was like right when they were trying to get rid of all of the back to school, um, they had the grab bags for $5 that included like just random um, sticker books and teacher planners. I was like trying to find one of the books that included a copy of the Fresh Start sticker book just so then that way I could get a second copy. I don't think I did. I was very disappointed. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take like these little pencils and I'm just gonna kind of stick them around, just kind of decorate over here. Um, I knew I was missing a pencil somewhere. All right, now I have to trim away some of these. Wait. Yeah, because I want it to look like that the pencil is somewhat behind the sticker. That is super cute. Okay, now this one too. We're going to cut it away. I love it. Okay, now all that we have left are these. So, how horrible would it be? Number one, I'm going to cover up the numbers. Because why not? And then I'm literally just going to stick them around and use them as like little decoration. So if you are ever looking for a way to use up the bajillion of the dots that are in some of the sticker books, just use them as decoration on the spread. I think it's, I think it's super cute. Um, I am trying to kind of like spread out the color and such because I don't necessarily want to put like a yellow next to a yellow. And look at that. I emptied out another sticker book, another sticker sheet. I could not be lucky enough to empty out a whole sticker book. All right, let's go ahead and put these pages back into the planner. So we have the 27th was using Fresh Start, which I do have a punch, by the way. So I'm going to get out my We Are Memory Keepers punch. I love this thing. It just does like a single punch. It has the same length stem as the Happy Planner. And it is just so easy when you just need to punch one hole or even, even multiple holes. I mean, it's super easy if you've got to punch holes in your paper in general. So fresh start for the 27th. We have Free Spirit 2 for the 26th. And then we have Free Spirit 1 for the 25th. I super love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it, if you like the spreads, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Um, I have hit the 1400 mark and my next goal is 1500 subscribers. Oh my gosh, you guys, I am so I'm so, so excited because like, I feel like maybe by the end of the year, I'll have 2000 subscribers, which would be amazing. You guys are seriously amazing. So thank you so much for joining me. I hope to see you at my next video. Bye. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and enjoy the next video.